Okay, we need a really thick pillar. Let's do the massive boy. We need this massive boy here. Oops, that's the wrong color. <gasps> yes, it's so big. Hey guys, it's Shadow, and today we are back here in Duckville for another episode. Today I am going to be building something pretty cool that I'm going to be basing off of something I went or I stayed at at Mackinac Island. So if you want to check that out, my mom made a video on it, so put it in the link in the description or in the iCard up above, I don't know, but uh, it is was called the Pontiac Lodge, I really liked it, and I'm going to be, ba so basically I'm going to be basing or making a hotel today. So what it was like, I think it was really creative, uh, like how it worked, um, it was, uh, Mackinac Island is a really pretty, quite an old historical town. Um, it's on a cute little island, uh, but I'm gonna be putting this whole plot as things uh, So there was like shops on the front like right here on the road on the main road um, And so I would I'm gonna put shops here like two shops here and then we're gonna have the hotel part like um, the reception kind of area over here then have like some stairs here because the uh, hotel it wasn't like a lobby elevators and stuff like something fancy like nowadays uh and so and then the stairs are going to lead up to the hotel rooms and the hotel is going to be over on the second story on the uh shop on the shops so yeah i think that's a really cool thing also last uh off camera i added little security cameras um so i can spy on people i'm just kidding i'm gonna <laughs> just uh, look at the town so this is like in the security booth um i can go in here and i can go to view security cameras we got one here that i already had i added one here by the uh, main road and then one here and one here that i just showed you and oh and one back here so and one there so in one there anyways we are going to be building a beautiful glorious uh, hotel thing so people can actually live here now and so I thought of this I was thinking about adding so I'm just gonna sh say it now I was thinking about adding um apartments or shops with apartments over them right here but I've changed my mind I'm gonna actually delete this and maybe put it over there um, or maybe I don't know uh, but I'm going to delete that and then I'm gonna actually put the apartments and stuff over here since the big buildings are like right here and uh, it looked w it would look re weird with there so I'm gonna put some residential lots um, right here so there's like a little neighborhood and there'll be like there'll probably be like four houses and I thought of adding a nice Victorian house because I feel like that would look nice it was like a round kind of area room thing uh, but yeah let's just get started Thank you. 
Okay, we need a really thick pillar. Let's do the massive boy. We need this massive boy here. Oops, that's the wrong color. <gasps> yes, it's so big. All right, guys, I have finished my shop hotel thing. I don't know what to call it all in one, but I'll just say it's a hotel. Uh, I really, really love how this turned out. I think it, it just... It, it just brings a totally different vibe to the town. I don't know, it just, it looks great. Uh, so down, so there's three things that is part of this. This took me probably about three and a half hours. So pretty long, but I mean, it's three buildings. So, well, it's one kind of building, but there's three shops and stuff into it. So the first shop is the gardening shop. Got some flowers on the outside on the windows. And we've got a little display thing here of the flowers and of some of the stuff. Uh, and, you know, just flowers and couches and more flowers. And then as we go inside, I love how this turned out. Um, it looks like, I don't know, it looks very filled, I guess. And I, that's what I really want in a lot of my builds. I uh, don't mind that glitching over there. That's just a weird wall, I guess. Uh, but I just, I really want to fill a lot of my builds. And this is probably one of the most filled, like, rooms that I've ever built. Uh, so over here we got some pots. I made this decal. Obviously, self-explanatory to just pots. Uh, we've got some, like, flowers, mushrooms, lilies, um, cactuses, sunflowers. And then over here, we got some showcasing mainly the pot, like, the, um, what, like, the pots or whatever that's in here. We got some carrots, got another cactus, some grass, bush, another grass thing. Uh, then we got some flowers on the walls to fill the space. I like this cobblestone. I used a lot of it in this whole duplex kind of thing. Um, I don't know if I would call it duplex. But over here we got the little counter. Um, very flowery. There's lots of flowers. Uh, if I came here in the spring, I would literally die because <laughs> um, I have pollen allergies. Um, we got some flowers and some pots and actually changed the colors of these because I, I liked them. Got a little watering can. I uh, got a I've seen an ATM uh, or a cash register. This is, I use the gate to uh, keep people out and so I can go in. And that's basically the gardening shop. One thing I love about this that I thought was a very cool idea that I thought of, um, I had it, so I had it at an angle obviously on the first floor, but then on the f second floor, it's actually like, you know, it's like actually like a square and like sticks out, I guess. I like that. Um, it looks kind of old-fashioned i guess uh but then over here we got the salon pretty basic i don't know it's i didn't really <laughs> it's, it's, it's self-explanatory also but um yeah i think i might decorate it more later off camera i was just really rushing to finish because it's like it's like 8 p.m right now and yeah and oh my gosh i'm i'm, <laughs> I'm at down to exactly 8,500 blocks box that's insane uh, so over here we got some seating got some books to read and some tissues then over here obviously you got the uh, so the, where you would get your hair done, and then we got the counter. Might have like a plant here or something. Uh, got like a barber um, pole, and then got the restroom. I didn't know what to do because this was really big. There was too much room in here, so I just added a restroom. Uh, so yeah, it's I, I would call it a salon or a barber shop. I don't know if there's a difference between that, but yeah, uh, I think a salon you can get your like hair dyed and stuff. But uh, then here, as you can see, here let me get my car. I'm gonna show you guys. Oh, also I added, I moved or I deleted the parking lot from here, uh, and then moved it over here. It's way smaller over here, but I mean it 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 does the job, you know. It does the job. Did we get your food? I just want to see this. Oh, <gasps> you fit. You don't fit. It's a little tight, but you can you can, you can get through here. I might need to change that to an angle instead of like a thin- Oh, <gasps> you fit! Yay! You fit! Success! So you would just- you would have to zoom out and then click it and then to take or whatever and yeah. And you stop here and then you go over to the uh, brand new The Cozy Nest Inn! That's what me and my mom thought of. Credit to my mom for helping me with all the names in Duckville. I can't really think of names. Oh, I just had a little bit of lag. I don't know why, but when you enter here, it's severely laggy, like really, really laggy right there. So yeah, I'm just gonna stay away from that, but we got a little couch here. I don't know if that's a little like thing. Yeah, it's just really laggy right there. There's nothing like above that would affect that. I don't know, I think it, it's not the plates or anything. So I don't know. I don't know. It's just a little bit laggy here. Uh, but over here we got like the front desk. Then at back here we got uh, where the employees would go. Like the I, I literally keep forgetting what it's called. 
I just got a little kitchen, got a little living room, dining table for you to eat, and then I got a little bunk here on the uniforms and like soundproof walls. Uh, so then as you, so you would check in there, then you would go up here, uh, over here got some trash, obviously, and then is this is the housekeeping, so I got all the towels and the stuff. Yeah, I don't know why, but my door trick isn't working. I think it's just because yeah, my computer's pretty hot, so I just need a break after this, but I uh, got the bear, of course. Now we have officially had the bear in Duckville. Uh, you can sit here. This is a little balcony, kind of, so I can look out there. Uh, then we got the little buffet over here. I didn't know what to add here, so I just add a little buffet. It's really tiny, but yeah, I don't know. Is this, is this what's affecting it? I don't know. I don't think so. Like, I wouldn't expect it to, but, um, oh my gosh, I forgot to change that picture. Um, ooh, that's, that's cool. Oh, that's pretty. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Done. <laughs> change the picture. Um, yeah, um, we got a little two-person table, then a three-person table. Uh, then over here, we got room number one. This is a, just a standard little one-person room. Nothing too special. It's got a TV, coffee maker. Yeah, just basic needs. And then over here, we got the balcony. So there's two rooms with a balcony and, uh, one without. So there's three rooms. And yeah, so we got a little couch here. You can watch the TV. Then we got the bed, obviously, and some nice pictures. And over here we got the bathroom pretty nice bathroom yeah the light switch is up here because if it was up here it would be merged into the wall trim so yeah i just put it up there but you can get to it still i uh, got some nice cobblestone got some nice pictures hair dryer towels and yeah then as we go over to room number two which also has a balcony got a nice oh that's actually really pretty Got a nice dresser and some co a coffee maker. Then over here, we got the bathroom. Same exact bathroom. Oh my goodness, I keep forgetting to change the pictures. All right, there we go. That's more like it. We got some nice mountain pictures that I literally just looked up in three seconds. Um, but yeah, I got a nice backlit mirror and stuff. Towel, same thing as the other room. Uh, the same bathroom as the other room. Uh, then over here, this is a nice little nautical theme going on here with the pictures. Double bed with a desk over here. And yeah, it looks pretty nice. Then it also has a balcony, which is nice. You get to stare into the roof, but you can also see the sunrise, which is this is it's really great. That's that's great. Uh, over here we got like a full-on cinema kind of the cinema kind of sh tr traditional shelf. I uh, got a coffee maker, microwave, uh, cooler. So this is the nicest room for the food supplies, but I mean, I don't really know why you would need that much. I added, th this was the first room I finished, kind of, so, um, then I added the buffet last, so, yeah. I got in this little chair right here, so you can sit here and enjoy yourself. Uh, this is the little corner where it hangs off, kind of thing, so that's kind of cool, kind of freaky. Oh, but yeah, nice, kind of small, but I guess it's nice. Uh, this is the different bathroom, same concept, like the nice, the same textures and stuff. Uh, same like sink and stuff, uh, but it's just a 4x4 four four instead of a 3x2. So yeah, got a nice shower here, and then a toilet, and then, you yeah, know, nice stuff. Also, these doors are the uh, front doors, so they have portholes because that's what um, hotels have, which is nice. Um, I think this looks really nice. I really like it. Looks re very nice. I also use, uh, Ikatori did this. She used counters to make those like vent things at the top of roofs. So I added that as a little detail and it looks, adds a nice detail to it. Anyways, guys, on that note, hopefully you did enjoy this video. Hopefully you guys like my, my two shops and the hotel over it. Uh, I really do like it, but I don't know what that lag kind of thing was. <laughs> you just like, I don't know. I didn't. I don't, I don't really detail that much, so I don't understand when it happens. Uh, but I do really like this. Hopefully, you guys like it. I love just looking up and seeing like two stories. Anyways, hopefully you did enjoy this video. If you did, please remember to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I have a goal for reaching 5,000 subscribers by the end of the year. Hopefully, I can get that. Um, are my plants withering? I don't think they are. What? They are. I have a what? What? Oh my goodness. I am confused. Yeah, whatever, I'll do it later. Uh, but thank you so much for watching, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy. Stay tuned for the next episode of, or subscribe to see the future episodes of Duckville um, builds and stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.